Hi Firsties, it's me, Mrs. Elkins. I have another new dinosaur book here. It's called What Happened to Patrick's Dinosaurs? And it's a second grade reading level. Some of you are getting ready to read at this level. Let me go ahead and read this to you now. Look at Patrick's dinosaurs. I wonder what happened to them. Let's go see. What Happened to Patrick's Dinosaurs? by Carol Carrick. And this time the pictures are by Donald Carrick. I love these illustrations. Patrick was helping his big brother Hank rake leaves. I used to have to do that with my brother too. Oh, there can be a lot of leaves during the fall. Where did they go? asked Patrick. Who? asked Hank. Dinosaurs, of course. Patrick never talked about anything else. He reminds me of Dino Dan. Well, some people think the world got too hot for dinosaurs, said Hank, and some think it got too cold. Maybe an asteroid hit the earth and covered it with dust. He showed Patrick, showered Patrick with a pile of leaves. That's not what I think, said Patrick. And what do you think, asked his brother. Let's hear Patrick's opinion, right? I wonder what his opinion is. What happened to the dinosaurs? Well, I think that once upon a time, dinosaurs and people were friends, said Patrick. There weren't any people then, said Hank. Cavemen came much later. Hmm, let's see. Well, the di people didn't live in caves, said Patrick. Dinosaurs built them cozy homes. I suppose there were dinosaur houses too, said Hank. That's silly, said Patrick. Dinosaurs didn't live in houses. They just made them. Hank smiled. What happened when the dinosaurs got hungry? He asked. And look at all those great houses the dinosaurs built. Let's see. Well, they knocked down trees and planted bananas, said Patrick. And they always shared. Can I have a bite? Wow, those dinosaurs sound really nice. And they weren't carnivores then, right? They were vegetarians. Then dinosaurs invented cars, said Patrick, because people couldn't run as fast as they could. Dinosaurs made cars, said Hank. Why not airplanes then? Could you, do you think dinosaurs made cars? I don't think so. Well, they did make airplanes, said Patrick. That's what Patrick thinks, right? And they made roads for people to drive on. <gasps> Wouldn't that make a great bridge? We could drive right over the dinosaur, right? Dinosaurs were big and strong, so they did all the work. That makes sense. If they did everything, what were the people doing all the time, said Hank? What do you think they were doing while the people worked so hard? Well... Oh, they got very bored, the people, said Patrick. So dinosaurs put on shows to make them happy. Some of the smart people learned to do tricks. Dinosaurs taught people tricks? Hmm, do you think that's true? I think it might be people. Well, dinosaurs wanted to teach people how everything works, explained Patrick. But people were only interested in recess and lunch. I have a student like that, just likes recess every day. Hank lay down on a pile of leaves. Patrick lay down too. Guess what happened then, Patrick said. I give up. What do you think happened next? Let's go see. Well, dinosaurs got tired of doing all the work all the time said Patrick, and nobody would even help them. So they built a big spaceship and they left. Dinosaurs couldn't fit in a spaceship, said Hank. Then how could they leave? Asked Patrick. I never said they left, Hank said. But they did, said Patrick, and they never came back. There they go into their spaceship. After a while, people forgot that there ever were dinosaurs, and they had to take care of themselves now, and they didn't even know how to. Poor people, right? It grew dark, and the first stars came out. 
Hank and Patrick watched as one bright star moved across the sky. You really think dinosaurs are out there? asked Hank. Patrick nodded. Yeah, but they must miss us, he said. And every so often they check to see how we're doing. Wasn't that a great story? So that's what Patrick thinks happened to the dinosaurs. I mean, what did happen to them? Where are they? I look around and I don't see any dinosaurs, yet everybody says they're real. So where did they all go? That's your opinion, right? We weren't there to prove it. A lot of scientists have different opinions of what happened to them. What is your opinion? What do you think happened to the dinosaurs? Get out your read and respond. I'll get mine out now. Mine is pink. Yours might be any color, as long as it has this metal binding. Take it to your next open page. Where do you think the dinosaurs went? I think the, the, do you hear it? That's right, T-H. I think, and then our sight word, the, T-H-E, dinosaurs. Let's sign, sound that one out again. D I know sores. S A U R S. I think the dinosaurs went. What and where? Where is your opinion? What do you think happened to the dinosaurs? Where did they all go? Write your sentence. Make sure you end with a period. And then draw and color your picture to go with it. I can't wait to hear what you write. Bye, firsties. See you tomorrow.